Är klockan redan 12? Shit. Ah, ja. But season 4 is out baby, so we have no pro- like it's fine. What up dogs, Steve here and I guess to the face, to the face. Yo, how are you guys doing? Today it's uh, season 4, just came out, which is super super fun. Um, I kind of have been snoozing on Call of Duty a little bit because I just didn't realize how freaking good Warzone is. And then when I realized how good Warzone is, I just started playing multiplayer again. Uh, and guess what? Scrapyard 24-7 is out. I have been testing it a little bit this morning, trying to get some good games. I mean, SBMM is, is in this game is pretty much what ruins it. Yes, the dishwasher is done. Anyway, so season four, you guys have probably already seen like five uh, YouTube videos uh, that kind of sound like this. Hold on. Yo, what's going on, everyone? This is your boy, uh, insert YouTube name, and today we got season four coming out, and we got Captain Fries in the rotation, and I have five fifteen thousand gold weapons. Yeah, the battle pass is out. Um, it's actually some really really cool things in it. I mean, first of all, Captain Price, where is he at? Right there. He's chilling. He's looking mighty fly, uh, mighty fly, Marty McFly. I was watching a Back to the Future Cinema Sins video a couple of days ago, so I was just, uh, I'm Marty McFly in my brain. There's a bunch of cool, uh, as as always, a bunch of cool blueprints. One of that I thought it was just super badass, which I probably won't use that much, is this uh, USP or USP, as we can call it looks really cool play you can even play a preview animation and it goes through it slow like this kind of like something you'd see on an only fans page i guess i've never checked one out but if you go all the way furthest back you can actually get uh nightfall uh captain price which looks really badass there's a bunch of cars and everything i don't really care for that much i just really like the uh blueprints that you can get from this uh what is this one Sometimes I don't know what gun it is in the beginning. It's a shotgun delta. Okay, it's just a shotgun. Whatever. Let's just leave it at that. Uh, nothing really new in the store that uh, cares to mention, but the Galil and the Vector are two brand new guns. The Vector, I haven't had time to really try uh, yet because it's just there. I think it... Um, it looks very tiny. It looks like something that they bring out in uh, the Matrix, which is pretty badass, I guess. Like, you go like this, and they start shooting. Uh, and the Galil, I have had the, the opportunity to level up a little bit before I started a recording here for you guys. Uh, I'm using the AX5 holographics, AXP5 holographics, and I know it's not the best hollow sight, but I have to get 50 headshots with it to get a new reticle um, for it. And uh, for some reason, that's my goal, to get the blue reticle. We'll see how long that takes. You know, there's probably 15 other 18-year-old uh, young YouTubers who's already gone, oh my God, welcome guys. You know, today I unlocked it. And you're like, okay, oh, all right, yeah. Well, that's cool. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? Uh, anyway, I think it's time to go and try out the Galil, showcase it to you guys, slap on a double weapon XP token for one hour. No, nope, I'm gonna save that until I am actually streaming. So let's just go to Scrapyard. Alchemist Dream? Oh, I, I don't think I have that. Mm. The menu in this game can be confusing enough as it is all right let's try not to suck this uh this game multiplayer will be this will be the best multiplayer in call of duty since modern warfare 2 if they didn't have skill-based matchmaking it, all right so listen up game developer imagine you're creating a game and you have players that are better than other people it's really really fun it's super fun shitting on people that you are better than I know this probably sounds like something you have never heard of, but playing uh, playing any any online multiplayer game, especially FPS, I play those so I could feel good about myself for a couple of minutes. Okay, that's an exaggeration, but you know what I mean. I just truly think that skill based hidden skill based matchmaking ruins it. This this map is. Very bright. Captain Price coming in. Oh, there's a guy behind me. I haven't really understood the spawns yet, to be honest. But um, I think 
Scrapyard seems pretty good. I mean, it was already in... What was it already in? In Warzone, of course. Uh, I do think there's something iffy with it. Isn't it... Isn't it mirrored? What have they done with Scrapyard? Yeah, it's mirrored, right, chat? I mean, oh shit, I thought I was streaming there, but you know what I mean, like, not chat, you know, YouTubers. Uh, yeah, this is supposed to be over there, like, on the other side, and, the like, that thing is supposed to be here. Yeah, it's completely flipped. Um, which is alright, I guess. They're probably hired like an intern to draw it or something they were like bro that looks fine no one will notice guess what infinity fort i notice and uh i'm getting wrecked right now but all right we're going up here gonna get our tag i'm, I'm gonna be camping i wonder how hard it would be for me, who's been playing mostly PC for the last while, to um, to get a W on Warzone with a controller. I mean, I know I want to play with Hex, and there's a couple of people who who are connecting their controller. Bro, I I can't see that guy. They're con connecting their controller to the PC to get the extra FPS and have that advantage over console players, but. Um, yeah, I think the Galil will be excellent in uh, in Warzone, where you actually have time to see people and outplay them, and not ma ma multiplayer matchmaking, whatever it's called. Because it is tricky AF to survive very long in this game. There's a laser sight, so that's maybe my teammate. I mean, it jumps very, very much. It jumps up and down, but I think there's probably going to be un unlocks for it that's going to keep it, be able to keep it down uh, a little better. Because the way it is right now, it is a little iffy. Yeah, it's a little iffy uh, in the recoil control. Uh, I also haven't just gotten used to it. I think with a couple of hours... Uh, with this uh, in my hand should be pretty good uh, after a while, but I'm bummed. I'm bummed out that shipment is gone uh, because it was. It's such an easy way of just getting a hundred kills for your uh, levels and stuff. So I don't know. Imagining that's also one thing. Imagine when you're being a map game developer. You're like, mm, I'm really pleased with my new map that I made. You guys like it? Call of Duty community goes like, hey, can we have shipment back? Can we have that old map that's 11 years old? Or whatever, 10 years? No, 12, 13. How, how old is Call of Duty 4, by the way? It's, long, it's old. I do like uh, that I have 45 bullets in my gun. I wonder, I do wonder how uh, some of these world records and gameplays with a bunch of Warzone kills are actually created. Because, at least in U EU, where I am at, the lobbies are never easy. Like, it's never you go into a Call of Duty, especially in multiplayer, you go like, you shit on people, like you're using Call of Duty 4 or Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. It's always pretty balanced. Hey, I got a UAV. Hell yeah. Screw the tags. Who needs tags, man? There's people over here. Nice little double kill. Another guy here. Done. Just because we can. I don't feel good about killing Captain Price, as you guys know. But what are you gonna do? He's in the game. This feels very, very good 
by the way, guys. Because it feels like we're doing a live commentary. And in almost Modern Warfare 2, besides the fact that it's SBMM. So for new, like now I'll complain about that for a while, but I, I actually have been trying to like, I was looking up some Googlings and stuff. And if there was a way to, to kind of mix or mess up your MMR, like you hit your, the, the, what, which is how the game calculates if you're good or not, or like if you're gonna get relaxing opponents or if you need try harder i was i don't know why i was just an ads in there uh so i actually like try to connect the controller try to search with that nothing really worked so you just the only way to get shitty opponents is to be bad i guess or possibly find a friend who's really really bad so you know hit up kyle or whatever his name is you know hey man oh you're on console yeah for sure man you want to play cool that's how you do it. Uh, yes, season four seems super cool. Galil seems uh, a little iffy with the recoil, but I'm um, hopefully it's gonna be able to level up. I haven't tried the white vector yet. It seems badass. Hopefully in Warzone 2, we're gonna get a little update on the map. We'll see. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you didn't, bye. <laughs> I'm <just> kidding. <laughs> uh, yeah, I will level up and I'll try to have as much fun as I can. I mean. Scrapyard, it is cool that it's back. I don't know who, how they could have, you know, mirrored it, I guess, or something, or flipped it. That guy should be fired. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you uh, follow the Twitch in the description, too. Peace out, guys.